We are headed to the presidential inaugural concert. What does it mean to continue with our democracy in the midst of so much turmoil and promised protests? How are we bringing people together? How can we focus on community and our love for one another as Americans together? There's a continuity of government that is continuing tomorrow, and this is the kickoff concert today. What does community mean to you? Coming together and uh, taking note of the small things that we agree on and trying to make the best of them. Absolutely agree with that. A community is where we come together. I know that sometimes everything can't go your way and you just kind of got to support every decision that a community makes because together that's what makes a community. Right on. Please welcome a theme Academy Award winning actor, John Boyd. So honored to be here to welcome you all to the inauguration of the 45th President of the United States, Donald J. Trump. Make America great again. What has inspired you to be here today? I wanted to see Donald Trump. He's going to be our president for the next four years, maybe eight. I just wanted to make the most of, of my opportunity here in D.C. to maybe get a chance to meet him and see what he has to say and what he can bring to our country. And as you look at all the people that have gathered here today and we see the tens of thousands that have come out to celebrate this new president, what, in your opinion, helps to bring a community together? What is the most difficult piece about hosting a community event that is truly successful? Generating interest. I don't believe Donald Trump has a problem with that. He's putting together a good event. He's going to have some good performers out here. I think a lot of people are interested to hear what he has to say in the election. community is being surrounded by people you love and also meeting new people with the same interests. It's also about like meeting new people and bringing other people into your community. Uh, we're on a close-up trip with our schools. We're just here enjoying the concerts the day before inauguration. It shows you that a lot of people with the same interests can get together and enjoy the same thing. Uh, this is a big community event here in Washington, D.C., but what does community mean to all of you? Neighbors and friendship and everyone coming together to have a good time. Right on. What else? Your immediate support group. That the ones you, people you rely on the most, like a family. A family. Yeah. For yeah. sure, like yeah. people around you that you really appreciate just being there. Like taking the first step forward in the future with people you like, people that support you. Just coming together and making America great again. What do you all think is the hardest thing about throwing or hosting a successful community event? Safety probably is like the biggest thing because everyone wants to feel protected and it's hard sometimes when you have people that aren't like the best around you but I feel like everyone here is like kind of nice and it's like it's really welcoming. Pleasing everybody, that's kind of impossible. I wish there was a way to give everyone the same opportunity maybe to get to the front. I only see a little dot as the person who's performing. <laughs> Got each other, we're having fun, we're having fun. That's community! What inspired you to be here today? Throughout my whole entire life, I was picked on about how I had a speaking disorder. I watched all of these rallies and everything of him talking and that stuff, and I, it's really big how he can go out in front of thousands of people and talk. I believe what we came out for is to see the experience, like not watch it on TV, yeah. just to learn that you have to have guts for this kind of stuff. And yeah, it's hard, but it got better for me, and like, I believe it made me so outgoing. Right on. Well, we better stay for the national anthem. Thank you for speaking with me. <laughs> it's something very, very special. And we're going to unify our country. Our phrase, you all know it, you half of you are wearing the hat, make America great again. That includes the inner cities. That includes everybody. <laughs>